This example is like problem 10 in the exam review. Uh, we want to determine whether the outcome is a type 1 error or a type 2 error or a correct decision. So we're testing uh, mean equals 100 versus mean not equal. Uh, the true value of the mean is 100, but the null is rejected. So the, the true value is 100, which is the null hypothesis, but we reject that. Well, a type 1 error is when we reject the null when it's really true, and a type 2 error is when we accept the null when it's really false. Well, here the null was true. Okay, true value is 100. That's what the null says, so the null is true, but we rejected the null. That's this case. We rejected a true null hypothesis. That is a type 1 error. Now, if it said that, uh, you know, the true value is not 100 and the null was not rejected, so that's saying the alternative is true, but we kept the null hypothesis. That would be a type 2 error.